levels and let's just be clear honey you think your skin look good these people are just be facading you bro don't get too happy why you talking about like tyra you ain't too far from being a skinny precious in the face them squinty eyes when you take your glasses off you're far less attractive so don't even try that with me we know you know damn well me and you standing next together on any given day bitch when i just wake up you know goddamn what i give nigga the fuck you think are you talking about i got a big ass forehead what do you think you look like have you not looked in the mirror lately take your glasses off and come live bitch you look like you precious up bro so don't go there and this whole you know i'm i'm born and shit why do you watch why are you so intrigued why are you interested move the fuck on nigga you can move on if i come on your channel and give you all the fucking smoke and you block me bitch because i will run you can go live and i come right over there and read your ass the fuck down bitch you know how i give it up just because i ain't on my channel don't fucking get too happy bitch and i told you one too many fucking times bitch you're 52 years old and you smoke. i'm 35 what the fuck that mean bitch i'm way better than you the fuck because you in a house with a man who's connected to somebody else get the fuck out of here bitch i'm trying to tell you you don't want me to be beef sex because i'll be on your ass you fake ass bastard bitch i've been trying to be nice to your ass whore i just now heard your shit all that shit you smoke and then you're in my chat the fuck out of here and then you want to keep bringing up my job and shit i don't give a fuck bitch do what you want to do ho at least i can get one chat it's Ooh. the chaplain it's the chap the chaplain where ho Ooh. you be job for i am bitch you're 52 and you, know, you work where ho you too worry about a point on youtube that's what you worried about get the fuck out of here you right her you know where you're going you weren't bitch talking about you got, you got somebody to pick the book up bitch you, you grab their bags so when you come off at the airport bitch get the fuck out of here you don't impress me ho. i done told you this one too many fucking times <laughs> i'm gonna keep bringing it to you and if you want to go live today and you want to get the numbers bitch i will hop on your panel and read your big ass you slim fast looking ass bitch yeah, you slim, all right. Fast and hell, fast as hell. Now I gave you your props and said, "Bitch, on your own." But it came too quick, nigga. And you think you big? Stand the fuck up, ho. Why don't you show your feet? Your skin look good. You go to what you say? You go to Trader Joe. You look like a Trader Joe ass bitch. You go to Trader Joe for your facial products. You might want to listen to me, bitch. The fuck wrong with you, nigga? Not on your back day. You in that car looking heavy as hell. Thomas, you know you want. I want to come live. Fuck you, bitch. Go to sleep, ho. Take a nap. Take a rest, bitch. It's Sunday. Give God his praise, ho. But you come talking about King Roman news, bitch. I done told you this, though, James. And this ain't nothing new, nigga. Fuck wrong with you, boy. I done told you. Stay in your lane. I'm all in my lane. 17, 13, 20 people or not. Born or not. You ain't gotta fucking watch me. Unsubscribe, bitch. Unrecommend, ho. The fuck you broke ass nigga. You look poor and cheap, bitch. Yo shit your pants all the way up your boots. Them boots look like they're from 97. You still wearing shit from your 30 year old days? Give it a rest, bitch. Talk about you got a partner. No, nigga, you'll suck this dick quick, ho. King, before I even said something about fluffing, here you go hopping on. Okay. Well, King Roman ain't even interested in me. Oh, you worried about that? Because you a suck dick, right? You fat ass hog. Don't come for me, bitch. You better stay pleasant, bitch, and stay over there before I be on your worst side, ho. The fuck wrong with you? you going to wake up and do this shit. And then you tried it on my birthday, and I tried to be nice to your ass on my channel. But I ain't on my channel. I dragged your fat ass down your street and back to your fucking house, you fat ass bitch. Fuck Bucci. Fuck Fuck, Bucci. fuck out of here. Now you go through that. And I'm telling you, I will click your link so motherfucking fast, bitch, and drag you. And you will have to drop me, bitch. You slim, fast looking ass nigga in that small ass car. And you think you're doing something. Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck off YouTube. I'm here for a coin. Bitch, let's start adding these cash, these super chats you get, nigga. Who got fired off YouTube, nigga? Who go, who grinder and, and shit on YouTube, nigga? You, not me. And you coming for me? I'm here to inform and tell people and share. And you got shit to say about me? You wake up on a Sunday and let me be your first thought. Bitch. You ain't mine. Now I give you credit and props because I'm a nice nigga. But I snatched that shit back so motherfucking fast, bitch the fuck wrong with you you better walk along you better carry along and sing a praise or one or two walk your fucking dog nigga the fuck wrong with you i told you i'm not here for you or near other bitch if i don't want to go back and forth with you bitch i don't have to but if you want me to i will slide over there and slide all up on your ass nigga yeah i will i ain't a pussy i don't need you for no clicks and no views bitch anybody subscribe to me because of jay wilson you are free to exit stage the fuck left 
How about that, Jay Wilson? You can unsubscribe for Jay Wilson. How about that, nigga? The fuck up with you, bitch. You can unsubscribe for Jay Wilson. How about that, nigga? The fuck up with you, bitch. You ain't got shit on me. Bitch, I'm 35 and I can move it quicker than you, bitch. Yeah, you better let San Antonio Police Department know, nigga, because that's the kind of nigga you are. But you be on YouTube talking shit all fucking day. Bitch, get the fuck out of here, you pussy. Now I'm done. Now, like I said, you can you're feel free to go live. I will give you the thousand you need, bitch, and drag your ass on your channel. Oh, you want to talk shit, bitch? You want me to be in the beef sector? Well, let's rock. Now let me say this, King Roman. <laughs> if you had said anything else but Deanna Irving that you liked her, if you had a product that reduces ankle fat, I would have been there for you. But let me just say this. I am not there for it. And if you had said that you has to reduce the swelling in my ankles, and Deanna Irvin said that it, and uh, you said that you liked me too when Deanna Irvin said that give it to Pastor Wilson, I wouldn't have had a problem with you. The thing about this is that Jay Wilson really should be ashamed of himself because that thing was so petty. Just because he said that he likes Deanna Irvin, it appears that was his major complaint. And like he said, Jay Wilson, you are over there in his chat. If he's so boring, why are you there then? I notice I'm saying a name, King Roman. I know he's on, but I got to go. And I'm not trying to mess up his um, numbers because, you know, he packs a man over there. So I ain't trying to mess up his numbers over there. But... King Roman is an interesting dichotomy. And I noticed something about King Roman. And I'm going to say it. And King Roman, I have no issue with you. I think that you are talented, but I'm just going to go ahead and say this. King Roman, it seems to me that you want the benefits of the beef sector without you want the benefits of the beef sector, but you don't want to claim the beef sector. And I just find that to be really funny. So you jump on the panels, uh, people come over, you don't want anything to do with the beef sector, but you will jump on a panel, you'll talk about people in the beef sector, you'll interview people in the beef sector. And I just think that's really interesting. You're either in or you're either out. Now, it's your decision, but I just think it is disingenuous to talk about people in the beef sector, to engage with people in the beef sector, half of your audience, people in the beef sector, but I'm not a part of that. And the thing is, King Roman, you know, without the beef sector, you wouldn't even have the numbers you have right now. Now, this is no beef. This is this is this is not a judgment. This is just an observation. So I just think it's really interesting. So he was talking about uh, a spray for your feet. And it gets off dead skin. And I told him he need to get at the Deanna Irvin. And he was like, I like Deanna. Well, okay, but but it is what it is. And I'm not mad at that, but I just noticed that observation. It's like you want the benefits of the beef sector without being in the beef sector. You know, and I just think that's interesting. Either you're in or you're out. 